What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Keep pasta, folks. Hold on, let me get a drink. It's been a busy day today. My Jets are at a 1 o'clock game. We're playing Miami. We're up 7-0. The Bengals, I get, I'm lucky enough to have a multiple games on. I'm watching Cincinnati because I'm talking talk about St. Louis might just be them. Well, St. Louis is doing a little rally right now, so I'm just, and I got videos I'm rendering, and I want to do all this stuff, so I'm a pretty busy guy, so let me get a drink of water first. <sighs> Thank you. And I'm losing weight, so I'm a little irritated, so let's go in and have some fun. Today I want to talk about how Turkey shot down a, a, a Russian a Russian fighter, Russian fighter, fighter, fighter jet. Now, there were reports of Turkey, uh, at, at the minimum, after, after multiple warnings, they shot down at the minimum, they shot two fighter, at the minimum they shot one fighter jet. There, there's rumors they shot two, at the least we can know where they shot one fighter jet now. Now. They shot the starter jet. I'll say they shot two just because, like, if you see one, you're more likely you're going to see another one. I mean, especially if it's time to type a mission that the GCS is doing. They're probably going to recon missions and just, just surveying the land type stuff until they found their uh, objective. But, uh, what happened was Turkey gave them, I guess, Turkey had the flight. I mean, the United States, we all these countries have flight patterns of planes that are coming in. And I guess the Russians were getting warnings. Well, well if, if you're bombing, if you're bombing Syria, the border's going to get blurred. I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not justifying what, what Russia did. But what we all know, we all know Putin. Come on, Putin said we didn't fly over. We all know Putin probably did. You know how he is. You, you can't give this dude a warning because he'll be like, ah, yeah, or whatever. You know the plane. You know the planes flew over Turkish airspace. Don't forget, Turkey told us, remember back in, the, well, I forget which war it was, Turkey told us that we couldn't fly over them, and they're in NATO. Go oh, yeah. so good luck, good luck with this one. And that's another story. Because, like I said, if Turkey, if, if Russia attacks Turkey, Section 5 of NATO says we got to help Turkey. That's why I raised talking about World War III, folks. Do the math. But, uh, that's another video for another day. But uh, the, the Vladimir Putin, he, he issued his fiery rhetoric about how the day, the day after the uh, how Turkey this, Turkey that. But at the end of the proverbial day, Turkey's a sovereign nation. If they're warning you about to fly over your their, their airspace, it could be the United States, it could be Russia, it could be ever. You don't fly over the airspace without their permission first. This, this isn't like nothing new to Vladimir Putin. What it is, is I'm sure they're, they're, they did it the first couple times. I'm probably. Who knows? Maybe they get did it all the time. But the fact remains that Turkey, Turkey gave them a warning. I don't think this is as much as the sh shooting down, as much as the, the video of it. People made, then, then you see, and then what happened was they shot him down. They shot him down, and he saw the rebels. I, I seen a video of this, and I, I seen and I seen it before a lot of you folks. And the people who know me know I got connects everywhere around the planet. I posted, if you got videos you want me to post, and you're, you're a world person, send them to my email, I'll post my email down there, send them my email, and I'll put them up. I had the bombing of home city in there. None of these other, none of these other people had it in there, did they? I have, I have the shooting in, um, in, uh, Rio, when they're in this, they're in one of these favelas, and I have both, literally just shooting like it's a video game. Go through my videos. I, I get this. I get this like news organizations get it. I get it before news organizations get this. But back to lecture and Boom, issues some fiery erratic, you know, Turkey's this, Turkey's a traitor, Turkey's helping ISIS, you know, but at the end of the day, he's not. If you saw the video, I saw when the plane got shot now, and then there's a, there's a, there's, there's three different videos. I'm gonna tell you there's two, there's three. There's, 
there's the one we get shot now, and there's two perspectives of the rebels on each side shooting at the guys in the air. I saw all three of those videos, and I, I think that was what really pissed the Russians off. Is you know, imagine they, 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 the, the Nazis did this shit too, no more world too. So like, say you ejected from the plane, you thought you were a safe haven. Nah, they're like, you guys, you know, you're, you're basically a sitting duck in the air. You know, they can either shoot your um, parachute or they can just, just, just pot shot you. That's what I think was going on. And what it is, is if you're in that southern, you're in southern Syria, you're in, you're in no man's land. Because that's ISIS, rebels, Assad's friends. Then it's all, it's one big clusterfuck. So it's, it's my friend and my friend is my enemy type deal. But uh, only after some prodding that Turkey finally, like, let us fly over, remember? Turkey, when I talk about, so I got off talking about that. Remember when Turkey didn't want to let us fly over during uh, one of the wars? We had to literally prod them, like, look, look, fuckers. You know, you're in NATO with us. How's this, how's this look? But, uh, well, Turkey, but Turkey has its own problem. Turkey has a problem with their Kurdish. Like, I, I, made, I, made, I made videos before, if you look at my, I think it might be on my Kobani, the one, one of the ones my feature video. Because if you look at my Kobani one, people are wondering how I got that information. I know Syrians. And I, I know I, I know Syrians that look like white people, but the only difference is, is they speak. When they speak, right off the bat, you know they're foreigners. Like, people don't understand, like, a lot of these, like, a lot, a lot of military people probably know what I'm talking about. Probably a lot of people who, if you've done, if you've done off, off, you know, off black, black ops type stuff, or if you, if you work in that area, defending whatever, you know them, them like, it, like from central to the north, those are white folks. They just happen to have Arabic, Arabic accents. And you would never know, like I said, there's this dude that I know, I can't, I can't say his name, I'm not gonna say his name, because the last thing I need is Homeland Security on his ass too. But uh, he, 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 he whew, I can't even say where he works. He went to school and he went to school. He came here because his parents, his parents, his parents, his parents are kind of semi-rich for over there. And so he came, he came to the United States to go to school. He's not going with his, he's not like 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 every other American who has a degree. He's not going. He's doing his field. He's he's a manager somewhere, but he's using his degree in, in like. He even told me, and a couple other series told me, the only people like the side is like the like the rich folks, because they're making out. Well, that's like every that's like well, that's like Putin. Putin only is the oligarch. So, and look at Obama. It's only the rich Democrats are making out because it sure ain't us po folks. But uh, let me get back to the topic. Well, I'm talking okay. After I said all that, now we're back on Turkey. Turkey has this whole problem. Turkey has this problem with its Kurds. Now its Kurds, Turkey made, told these guys, don't go down to Iraq to help the Kurds in Iraq. Here's where Kabani comes into play. If you go to Kabani, it's a Turkish, it's a Turk, it's a Turkish, not a Turkish, it's a Kurdish stronghold. Now you had the, 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 the Iraqi Kurds were getting pummeled. So we had the Syrian, the Syrian Kurds helping out the Turkish Kurds, and now also the PKK or the, the PPK. This is the Kurdish party. They have a problem with that too, because they, they want to outlaw that. And now you have Russia bombing. Uh, you have Russia, Russia complaining about Tur like trying to bomb uh, Syria and Turkey. Turkey has the right to, like I said, Turkey has the right to defend itself. But at the same time, you're not making the situation easy. Turkey's trying to be like, Turkey's trying to, if, if, if I look from my side, Turkey's trying to be ultra neutral. Because they don't want their Kurds, they don't want their Kurds to kick up dust. Because they're already, they're already like, hey, look, man, we're going to help out our, our, uh, our brothers and sisters down in Kobani and northern Iraq, which they are doing. But Turkey's like, hey, look, don't do it. Now, even though we have a problem with you, don't do it. But like I said, Turkey has the right to defend himself. I'm gonna do a video because there's something else can do a video and like link it. Tell me how I'll promote. I don't care. I'll tell them. 
We're in NATO with these with these dudes. We're in NATO. Why do you think people started saying talk about this World War Three stuff? Because you know why? Because if we attack, if, if Turkey, Turkey did what they did, say, say Russia attacked Turkey, and Russia was talking big shit, but they're going to do it. Here's why: if Russia attacks Turkey, Russia better be sure that none of the pilots came over in Turkish airspace, because that's what sets the, set the whole thing off anyway. But we found out that Turkey, Turkey, like was telling the truth. That means Russia started the war for nothing. But back to what I'm saying: NATO Section Five, what's it, Article Five, Section Five, whatever. Say like Russia attacks Turkey, we have to jump in it because of that. That's why people are saying World War II and all this and that. So you need to watch this because it's going to be a good situation. But Russia's Russia's won Turkey for Thanksgiving. We're not going to get it. So peace. Great guy. He's always on himself.